Hello everyone, welcome back. Thank you for joining me for some more Baldur's Gate 3 tonight. As we continue our adventures in the lower city, we got our wizard tiefling character. I think we're level 11 now. We have like 77 or something hours in the game. Um, in Act 3, obviously, and I think we're about to go talk to Mistra. We recently went through the bookstore and did that whole thing, had the interaction with Elminster, and now it looks like we can actually go speak to Mistra, and I'm interested to see like how that is going to work out. So, let's hop back in. Oh, okay. Dio. Dio. Dio? Okay. D <laughs> Buddy, do you want to say hi too? You want to say hi? <laughs> Oop. I don't want to get his foot caught. There you go. I want to make sure I don't get his him all tangled up in the headphones when I flop him down. There we go. Alright. <laughs> oh, cats. Alright. Cats allowing. Let's continue. Alright. Where were we? So... Oh, we were going to go also say hello to uh, Leroican with Daemalin. She just kind of like ran off. And I'm thinking I might want to go in here before we long rest. I don't know if it matters or not, but like she did say that she was going right now to go to him. And I, I just feel like she would appreciate if we help her sooner rather than later, you know? Here goes nothing. I did steal his text. What have we here? A magician in a tower, Phil. hiding away from the frightening world. What are you so scared of, Magus? Not the night song, surely? Why, she's nothing but a relic to be purchased and pursued. My God, the night song is a person. Oh, there's Roland. Found him. By my honor, it's you, my dear. I. Maybe. Thought you were. You will address me with due deference. I am Dame Aelin. And you are a wealth without honor, without pride, with nothing but a <laughs> tower full of trinkets. Oh. My apologies, Dame Aelin. I meant no disrespect. Perhaps we could start over. I am the Rowican. I am most pleased to make your acquaintance. And that of your fine companion, who perhaps heard I was looking for you. Really? Hmm, is that how our encounter... So this is interesting. So this is basically kind of acting as if we haven't had, like, our whole encounter. But, like, is he just pretending? I don't know. Like, we already know why. <sighs> Dame Aelin, I have discovered... A device that would allow your immortality to be shared. It would cause you no harm, no pain of any kind. You serve your mother, Saluna, I believe. She who has blessed our realm with so many gifts. Honor her by sharing yours. You do not seek to share my gifts. You seek to poach them. Ooh. You dare to threaten me with the same magic that held me in torment for a hundred years. <laughs> I had hoped to appeal to your better nature. Perhaps I overestimated you. Hmm. No bother. I have an arsenal of implements capable of convincing you to see reason. They say madness and genius are separated by but a hair's breadth. <laughs> Perhaps the same is true of madness and stupidity. Uh, yeah, maybe. You can have the immortal. Oh my gosh, no. Um, yeah, that would just make Dame Aelin also kill us. Yeah, no, so he's, he's dead now. But his magic lives. Hmm... I'd hoped you to keep an open mind, but it seems you're determined to make this as difficult as possible. Boy, at the ready. 
Once I've taken control of the Asimar, she must go directly into the caging runes. No, Master Lerorkin. Oh, nice. I would never have assisted you if I knew you planned such horrors. You lied to get the Night Song here. Made us all believe she was nothing but a relic. I oh. have seen what true leadership can accomplish. But never under your tutelage. Ooh. Put your tongue, you child. Ooh. I could make it such that no wizard in the realm will touch no you. No wizard? We have two in our if party they're all currently. Like you, I think that sounds like an excellent bargain. Ooh. <laughs> Oh, face us, Ooh. charlatan! We got rolling on we our side. Detest you so. Ooh. Mamadons, Imperatum. Okay. Um. Here goes. Sure, this is gonna be uh easy, huh? Also, I do not mean to have the armor toggled off. How do I toggle that? I don't even know how I do that. Oh, look at that! Ha ha ha! Ha ha ha! I didn't even realize that was a thing. Got it. Okay, anyways. What's happening here? A lot of critical hits. Oh dear. Lots, lots going on. It's not my turn yet, though, so... Now I pay attention. Right. <laughs> I don't think I really want to care about those things as much until... Okay, so I want to make sure that we don't let Roland die. So I want Shadowheart or someone to take care of him. Help him out. Heal him. Probably just like literally throw a healing potion. Probably will be the best option there. Um, I really wish we'd had a short rest for this here because then we could action surge and stuff. We can do this though. <laughs> yeah, too bad, critical miss. And then Laro again. Let's attempt to, what? Push you off balance? Yes, off balance, good. Elemental Retort. Oh, that can be a lot of damage. Yeah, let's very much... Uh, no, let's have him counterspell that. Oh, I could have also Psionic Backlash. I didn't realize. Now I know. Can I help him up? No. Not enough action resources, but we can. Do that again. And that again is not not it. So we're just gonna use our limited spell slots and we're gonna we're gonna do that. Yeah. Yikes. Yikes, she is lower on health. And Larogan is dead. So Nice! Um, I thought that that was gonna kill these things. Um, it seems that they were not summoned. They just are existing, which is great. That's, that's lovely. I was really hoping they were his summons, but nope. We just got a lot of journal updates, too. I'm gonna have to, have to look at that. Oh, was it a failed counterspell? Oh, good. Alright, we don't have any more actions. What is that? That's quite something. I was hoping this thing would be dead. I am silenced. So that's okay. Yeah, that's the silencing area. Can I like not be in that? Light on my feet. Okay, good, 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 good. So let's use this cool new spell. We also have disintegrate. That's kind of sweet. Let's try disintegrate. No, oh, that's a thirty percent chance. That's a hundred percent chance. Let's do that one instead. Okay. Okay. That's kind of cool. I like that. I like it. One can't always be a gentleman. Let's move out of that. Yep, no more silence. Thank you. Duh. Oh, I haven't had Roland go, so I need to make sure that Shadowheart helps out Roland. Yeah. Oh, this guy. I don't know if this guy actually really needs to die. He didn't really seem to want to be here in the first place. But, you know. Okay. What is my plan? Like, madness. Like, oh, we could try telekinesis. That's only a 50% chance, though. That's going to be immune to psychic damage. 
No? No. If it hits, that would be kind of crazy. We could also just do straight damage, though. I may want to consider casting, like, Wall of Ice. Like, right here and all the way across. You know? Uh, no, that hits her, though. I think that will still technically hit them. I don't know. We're going to find out. Target is blocked. No, like... Okay, what if I start on this side? And then go like that. No, that didn't work. Why didn't that work? Nope, that doesn't want to work. Okay, that's fine. I tried. Uh, I am just going to... I need to just hurry up and take a turn. It doesn't really matter what I do. Let's just try this. Let's see if this hits. It'll be crazy if it does. Hey, it does. That's neat. Cool. And then let's have him, like, what? Like, go over here or something? Go join the party? Yeah. I'm gonna do that. Feel better about assassinating this guy in your evil playthrough? I mean... Yeah, Larokin. He does not seem like uh, the best. So she can't really get over there. But she can probably throw a healing potion. Can I send that to her without it taking a turn? We're about to find out. Throw one. Maybe I can hit them both. There we go. Well, rolling. Hope that helps. That took like all of my movement. So let's actually, let's move out of that. So we lost silence. Good. <coughs> Quite an effect. Roland, you good? You okay? He's silenced. He really needs to move. Nice armors. Yes, I have been checking out the dies. Thank you. Did that guy die? That guy super died. Well, yeah. I was gonna try to save him if I could, but you know, oh well. That's, that's, I guess he shouldn't have worked for Larokin. Like he should have stood up against him like Roland did. So I don't feel that bad. Okay, Karlak, your health is quite low and we still have both of these elemental things alive. And I don't love that. I don't love it at all. So we gotta just do our best to knock him out. Um, that's how that's going. Okay. Okay, at least that hit. Thank you. Thank you. Goodness. All right. Nothing important is ever easy. And turn, and then we're just gonna scooch forward just a little. And then... Maybe like Cloud of Daggers or something? It'll do some crazy damage. Uh, I'm worried that they're gonna do take damage. No, I'll do that to this one. I didn't hit Gale, did I? Oh, I think I might have. Dang it, I was specifically trying not to. That's okay. All right, use a potion. Let's use, like, a better potion, maybe. Uh, 
Yeah, whatever. That works. Alright, Gail, let's get out of there. Ooh. Okay, well, he already moved out of range of that one, so let's just have him... Is he in the cloud of daggers? Yes, he is. Okay, I've just got to have him take the hit and get out of that. Or not! What was that? Oh no, he's not dead. Okay, he's just knocked over. I'm like, what in the world? Not cool. She can't even cast Spirit Guardian or anything. No, that's okay. Um, we're gonna have her... Could put him, like, off balance. Let me try to put it off balance. That could be really helpful. Okay, it is off balance. Perfect. Um, are they immune to poison? Yeah. Alright. Oh, and of course that thing teleported out of the cloud of daggers that ended up being ultimately much more difficult to deal with than they were worth, but that's alright. Hmm. Can't wait to get this game. It's a fun one. Just be patient when you're learning it first. There's so much going on. Okay, at least he cast mage armor, um, and then he got got himself silenced. Good job. Not the easiest fight here. Who's using fly? Oh, good, there's more. Oh, goody. Oh, ah. Okay. Nothing will stand in my way. No more Cloud of Daggers. That's not helpful anymore. Not helpful. What is helpful? Are they immune to necromancy damage? No, they're not. So, I can do that. I can do Blight. At that point, we just do Disintegrate, right? Yeah, at that point, we do Disintegrate. And... 30%, 40% chance? At least a 50% chance. Oh, jeez, that's not a very high chance. But we gotta risk it! And it did not pay off. I was really hoping that would pay off, and then it just didn't, but that's okay. That's kind of tragic. Okay, that's, that's fine. Everything's fine. Um, it was going well. Larokan's dead immediately, and then I thought these things would maybe like not attack us after he was dead, and then that's just not how it's gone. Hey, we have an advantage on this one. Let's do that. Yeah. Mm. Now it doesn't matter as much. Holy fire. Branding smite. No, neither of that is very useful. So just... Okay, apparently doesn't matter. Try this one. Neat. I stamina to heal myself. Sure. A tale for the ages. All right, Gail, what do we got here? Mm. Okay, can I possibly... I think they're immune to fire damage, so let's not use any fire spells. Let's use... This one was pretty good, but that's not like a very high damage percentage. Fireball we can't use. I need to switch up his spells. I think I said that earlier, too, and then I didn't. So maybe just do this. See what happens. Ooh, that's kind of cool. Oh, that did good damage. Well, it also just moved him. That's kind of interesting. Okay. Something different. Then, Aelin, where are you going? Oh, you're going over here. It's, like, not really the one I need you to focus on. Can we, like, focus on the same one at the same time? 
Okay, she's taking a lot of damage. Um, I'm a little worried about her at this point. Maybe long rest, not long resting was like not a good idea. We might need to go back. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, jeez. Uh. Did Roland... Who's, who's on the ground? No, that's Laroican. I'm like, where's Roland? Okay, Roland's still alive. Okay. This thing needs to die. Please just die. Thank you. Okay, this one also needs to die. Carlac, saving the day. Thank you. All right. We actually have a chance still because Carlac did that. Good job, Carlac. We need to help her out. We may need to have Sh Shadow Heart or like someone, anyone. Oh, geez. He's really low on health, too. Need to have like anyone get some healing going. I wish Shadow Heart more had more healing slots, but she does not. No more spells. Um, I guess we just see what we can do here. Um, that missed, but that one's not gonna. There we go. The witching hour. The witching hour. Yeah. So. She should be fine if we just do some good damage. That worked last time. I was hoping it would. We did not hit the roll for that. Did not hit the roll. Okay, bonus action. What do I want? I want, what, like level three spell slot or something? Oh, I can recover a level six spell slot? Might as well. Cool. All right, Damalin, helping out. Super stunned, unfortunate. Ouch. Okay, but Carlax clown makeup, this may be an opportunity to get rid of it. I may need to just let her die. Shocking grasp? That's kind of interesting. Do opportunity attack. And I don't think they get poisoned. Alright, we're almost down to it. There's what, two of them left? We've got this. We've got this. Alright. Uh, I'm not even really going to worry about Karlak right now. I am going to worry about using that though. Okay, good. Good start. Can I, like, beast? No, it must be a beast. Dang it. I do have hold monster or something, and I, for some reason, do not have that equipped, which is unfortunate. All right. What can I do for the most damage here? There's not, like, a lot I can do. We can try to... Now, see, that's, like, a 35% chance. Like, that's not... It's not a very good chance. And also, they don't take any poison damage, and he has, like, a lot of poison stuff. And he has a lot of fire stuff. And neither of those are going to be very helpful. At that point, just I'll do blast. Yeah, that critical hits a lot. A lot, at least. So, do what we can. All right. What do I want to do here? So she can't rush attack or anything more, anymore, um, but she can. You take like half damage or something, that might be kind of good. Duplicity might be kind of helpful actually right now. At least get a little bit more distraction going here. Yeah, that should be helpful. Yeah, there we go. Okay, if it stops her from getting hit, 
Thank you, Roland. Running in, running out. Charm, sure. Tadpole charm, yay! All right, so Dave Allen's right here. I'm a little worried about her, but hopefully I can just pick her up like I can pick up Carlac before anything crazy happens. Let's just magic missile here. Well, that's up to 15 damage. That's up to 24 damage, so what's that? But I see the problem. That misses and the other one doesn't. Okay. Well, that's not great. Not great. Not great. Destroyer. We're like, we have a lot invested in this battle at this point. So I, okay. This thing is like right here. I would love it if maybe it would like not be right here. So maybe I, Misty Step. Uh, no, but Misty Step is gonna take like a crazy spell slot and I don't really wanna do that. Lightning charges, yikes. Ah. Uh... Is it just this one now? Is it just this one left? I think it, it's these two. That will super murder Carlac, but at this point, I'm sorry, Carlac. For the cause. For the cause. <laughs> See, she's even fine still. See, she's fine. Uh, maybe. Don't worry about it. That did good damage to them, so I'll take it. <laughs> Oh, there goes Garlic. It's okay. The clown makeup will be gone, and we're gonna red serve with the scroll. That was somewhat intentional. We now... Okay, they're almost dead. They're almost dead. Almost. So, this is not... Not really like an ideal percentage for what I'd like, but let's see. Hey, we hit him. We did some damage. Oh no, Gale. Oh no, Gale. Gale's dying. Gale's dying. Oh, we're all dying. We're all dying. It's okay, we're almost there though. We gotta pull through. Ah! Good. Okay, it's almost dead. That's huge. Good job, Dame Aylin. Good job. Yes. All right, this is when... Wow. All right, sorry, Karlak. We're gonna pick you up very soon here. <laughs> Wonder if the gods My apologies. Me. Okay, what is the thing immune to? Not fire. This thing is not immune to fire. That's helpful. Target cannot use reactions. That might be helpful if I use that and that actually hits. Oh no, I have to be close enough to use that. But I can be close enough to use that if I use the misty stuff that's on my boots. No using reactions. Come on, just... No, it missed! Oh, that was gonna be the move. That's okay, it's alright, it's alright. We didn't need it. We didn't need it anyways. <laughs> Dame Aylin's gonna... Come in! Finish him! I love that! You who had purchased my submission with profane gold. Let every wicked magus, every vile murtherer, each slaver Murthera? and misery merchant see. Dame Aelin is watching. She is indomitable, and when her face lights the shadows of your wrongdoing, you are broken by its beauty. <laughs> broken by beauty, yup. <laughs> yup. Okay, let me help pick up Gale before he actually dies. Okay, there we go, and then... 
Where's the scroll? We gotta revive Karlak. Take your own. There you go, Karlak. I need your help. She's like, oh dear. Is her clown? You're joking. You're joking. You're joking. You're 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 kidding me right now. The clown makeup lives. That was supposed to be the fix. That was supposed to be what fixes. No. I can't. Oh my god. Okay, whatever. That's that's funny. All right. Good times. Let's loot, and then let's speak. Hello. The firehead fool is quick saving. It's dead. Yet as I stare upon his corpse, I feel sadness. Why? That was that was quite something. Because you won't get to kill him again. Oh, okay. What kind of sadness are you talking about? A gripping in the chest, as though I'd lost someone. Something. Uh, uh, Paladin's fatigue. What? No doubt. What? You were excellent in battle, as is your way, and I am proud to fight at your side. What is that alluding to? And you, Tiefling, you did not embarrass yourself. I will catch my breath, then to camp I will bring my bones. Are you talking to me or Karlak? Moon Maiden, be with you. Could be either. Oh no, she's talking to Roland. Oh, there's three Tieflings here. How much here. can I go? The Rurikin is dead. The bastard is dead. Yeah, Karlak's face paint is apparently a tattoo. <laughs> yeah, we'll have to try the applying fresh makeup and sleeping. We'll have to try that. Um, you okay? I am. Now that the bastards and bits. <laughs> Leroican was a cruel and vicious man. By day, I'd tend the shop, but at night, he'd fire the most nonsensical questions at me. And for every one I answered wrong, he'd beat me. I could have killed him with my own two hands. But I kept thinking it was all a test. It had to be. A wizard. I thought it was the price beating I him. had to pay to become a, a true wizard. I realize now he was just a sick, sick man. Yikes. Poor guy. Um... What's next? I see things clearly now. If I wish to master the weave, I must do it myself. Thankfully, I have everything I need right here. All hail Roland, master of Ramonith's Tower. <laughs> I'm gonna say that, that's kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I like the sound of that. I do indeed. I'll move Cal and Leah in immediately. The Roican refused to let them stay here. They are gonna love the tower. I wouldn't have this, the tower, my family, without you. What can I do to thank you? Oh, the Emperor's like, be an ally. Yes, I need allies. Oh, that's important. I feel like that's gonna be important. And you'll have me. I'll learn everything I can about the tower in the meantime, even if I have to rip this place apart. But know this. Ramazith's tower and its master are now your friends. And when the time comes, we will stand by you as allies. Hmm. Well, that's pretty neat. How oh, nice. Um, that's probably going to be a great ally for us to have. I want to take a look at this letter. Here we go. Loroican, I have responded out of respect to my counselor, Balthazar. Oh yeah, no, we read this. Yeah, no, he was asking about uh, Thorm, how he was getting his immortality. That's funny. Okay, I think that's all we needed to do here. Oh, there's a throne, a book throne. Can I interact with the book throne? Do you think Roland would get mad? Oh, did I even did I even loot Leroican? Hang on. What's in here? 
What is this? Mirror image. Hmm. Advantage of... Eh, that's like... Okay. The despair of Athkatla? That looks pretty good. That I'm interested in, but... I don't know. We have a pretty good one, too. I do want to end the day. Yes, please. Charlotte, thank you. Welcome on in. It was definitely a witch hat kind of day. There's so many random things in here. Owlbear. Yeah, that's like a cursed book. That's good. Bunch of unarmed things. Hmm. Not a bad, bad weapon at all. On my way. Okay, anyone to talk to? Let's talk to Chatterheart. Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Oh, hello. Of course. Hmm. A kiss. I thought you'd never ask. How cute. Don't mind our lifted creepiness. <laughs> also, in spell DC is great, right? Like, really not a bad thing to take. Fine. What's on your mind? Okay, let's go. Hey, Malin, you got anything to say after all that? Ah, uh, ally mine. We are reunited once more. Okay, happy to see that she I returned to camp. I was just regaling sweet Isabel with tales of our prowess. Very impressive. Thank you for helping Aelin. That wizard sounded absolutely dastardly. <laughs> um... Yeah, he, he had it coming. He did, <laughs> and it came. Now, my friend... Bask in your victory. I will do the same. My darling, we must inform our friend of our news. Indeed. I've scouted a Salunite enclave outside the city. They faced the Absolute's armies and come out battered and bruised. Aelin and I will go to them, provide what help we can. But fear not. When the time comes for you to face the foe of foes, Isabel and I will stand by your side. That is nice. We wouldn't miss it. Not for anything. Go well, friend. We will see you soon. And with our great powers combined, this city will be saved. Nice. Withers got anything to add? Fate, dost no. thou require a new... Gail. Oh, we have another... We have another note. Dame Aelin has oh. little to feel sorry about. The Roacan would have inflicted a far worse fate on her, given the chance. Yeah, that's fair. Yeah, so what's the deal with Elminster? I've often asked myself the same question. i never really found a satisfactory answer. You clearly see something in me that I can't. The wisdom and intelligence required to overcome almost insurmountable odds, perhaps? All the stupidity required to attempt it. I take it as a compliment either way. You don't get to be 13 centuries old without becoming a sound judge of character. And cheese, apparently. You gotta know good cheese. I'm not gonna ask him if he regrets that, no. I expected Night Song to be overjoyed after killing her fair-haired fool. Instead... She just seemed tired. I wonder why. There's got to be a reason for that. Where do you feel the same way when you kill Casador? She's probably just a better person than you are. <laughs> yeah, no, I mean. Are you worried? <laughs> Hardly. It's going to be the greatest moment of my life. The blood, the screaming. <sighs> Just thinking about it makes me smile. Okay. Well, if you insist. All right, let's see what our new creepy blood note is. 
Another letter from Orin. Thanks to you, the tyrant's iron throne lies broken beneath the bay, and the prisoners it held are nothing but blood in the foam. Fishermen will be finding succulent morsels of gnome flesh to decorate their dishes for years to come. You sow the seeds of chaos well. How the sheep bleach to watch their gilded guardians crash to the cobbles. They tremble to see the lordling's temple of tyranny crumble atop their corpses. The time is now. Without his mindless mannequins, Gortash is weak. Kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him, kill him! Orin. Normal things. Normal. All, all normal. I didn't mean to blow up the gnomes. That's, if I did that, that was not my intention. Where'd the girl go? Meow. Meow. Greetings, cat. Does it know anything about Yenna's mother's fate? Ooh. Ooh. I don't have a bonus for this. But I roll it. Okay. We love to see it. The cat peers back. You read something in its eyes. Doubt. Resignation, perhaps. Greetings. Oh, okay. It, it's classic. Classic cat. Or we need the spa day? Yeah, might help, you know? Aelin never returned to your camp after the fight. I think they fixed that in the most recent patch. I heard that that was a thing that could possibly happen, so I'm really happy they didn't. All right, well, let's go to bed. Why, why select so many? We don't have to do that. There we go. You sleep, but the wicked don't. Oh. Someone is here to disturb oh. your rest. Oh. Get the hells away from me! Oh. Oh. Peace, brother. We're here to take you home. The master needs all seven of us for the ceremony. Come with us and be reborn. We'll live again. Oh. How did you find us? Master Kazador has known where Astarian was this entire time. Oh. He knew he would return. The right. The master needs him. Uh, he must attend. Uh, what a no? lovely invitation. But I'm afraid I'll have to decline. I intend to kill him, you see. We will live again, Astarian. The scars on our backs are sealed with the cruelest power. Seven spawn, seven sigils. Your number seven, the final piece of the right. He needs us all for the Black Mass. Our fates were sealed in his writing long ago. A promise to his favorite spawn, fulfilled in the crypt beneath his palace. Do I have, do I have a choice here? Is no. Our only chance to be free, to end centuries of slavery. You will not ruin it, Astorian. Oh. What? Did he just use the fireworks? What did he just? I love it. Well, I was not really intending on fighting them right now. Okay. Oh. So... Steeped in bliss? Why are we all steeped in bliss? What? No. Was there supposed to be more dialogue choice during that pause or something? That's what I'm wondering. I, did that bug out? Do I need to reload that? Did I have a choice there? Did I have a choice? I feel like I might have. No, right? Like, it. I don't know. Maybe it was just the illusion of choice, right? Oh, and I didn't even swap out his thing. Okay, well, this should do great damage to vampires. Yeah. 
Where is the Starion? That's him. Okay. Gotta make sure I don't hit him. Nice. That was good. This is gonna feel good. Okay, Karlak. Let's do a little little cleave here. Ooh, we missed one. Not that one. <gasps> okay, well, apparently we need a precision attack because we are just missing. Please. Thank you. And then... Disarming attack? No, that's not really gonna work. Let's just run in there with a regular old attack. And... We could use some of the die. No, let's just try. Oh, I should have. That's okay. No choice but to keep going. A little, little magic missile, maybe? Or. Yeah, that's not very accurate, is the main thing. Flammable target. Can I go forward? Are they considered flammable? We're about to find out. Oh, I'm dead. Hey, they are considered flammable. Neat. Need to act fast. All right, Shadowheart, you wanna you wanna just end this situation here? Thank you. Are we just like partially rested? Is that what's happening right now? I think so. Oh, thank you, Astarian. It's kind of interesting to have the AI control him like that. Have access to our stuff. Bite on Carlac? No. Do not bite her. Okay, can she go first? Let's no just... blood. Boop. This needs to end. One way. Yeah, apparently or sooner rather than later. Another. I was gonna go Can't talk to Mistra next, but right. I need to get to that crypt and find out what these damn markings are really for. Yeah, Starion made the choice for you. Okay, it seems like it makes sense. I mean, that's fine with me. Wow, so that wasn't actually like considered a full long rest. So I may want to consider taking him and our party real soon here. Um, that's interesting. So let's go do the thing with Mistra, and then let's go do a Starion's thing. Oh. That's a cat. Is that the cat from, uh... Let me see. Animal speaking. Oh, we only have one right now. Well, we're using it. Interviews, politics, gossip. All of it gets in that bloody boulder's mouth. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What was that? Could you, could you repeat that bit? It speaks a feline dialect called Mriar. It wants to know if you're its mother. What? It's me, my son. <laughs> what is, is that bad? Is that messed up? I don't know. Can I, I, I will be, I will be your mother. Wait, can you come with me? <laughs> a cat accent. Yes, I love it. Oh my gosh. Okay, where am I going? I'm not going where I need to go. Mister is over here. Mister. Okay, well, I hope we get to see that cat again. Oh my goodness. I'm a mom now. Oh. Oh. What a good moment. Okay, someone in this building is apparently- oh, someone up here is apparently on a murder list. And I need to warn them, and then we'll go to Mistra. Who's this, Rig? I'm rather enjoying the wipes. 
Maybe you should give it a try. Ooh. Maybe I should. Help with the <laughs> some wine, please. Okay. I wish I had some wine. Welcome. I'm not really a wine person myself, but freeze free. This is suspicious. Why is there so much free wine? Is someone here who could potentially get murdered? Who's who's core? Like, there's so many people here. Like Lud, who are you? A fine festival indeed, wouldn't you say? Yes, fine festival. Like Zinfandel. You know, they're just <laughs> giving out free wine here, calling it a sample. Very cosmopolitan. Oh. Who's in charge? Maybe you? Why, hello there. We were just about to try some of Master Metzley's delightful wines. Oh, this is Cora. Oh, would you care to join us? Oh, they do look ever so tasty. Ah, Mrs. Highbury, I prefer to conduct tastings wait, individually. Wait, wait, wait. So Red. I may assess Red. Your Red. Call wait. Me Cora, Master Metzley. He's wearing and red. I'm afraid I must insist on their joining us. Wine's no good without company, after all. This guy's really suspicious. Say failed medicine. Yeah, like, no. Yeah, your life is in danger. No. no. I must say, if yes. this is a practical joke, it's not very amusing. Why, a serial killer? Oh, that's terrible. Master Metzley. Yeah, where, where, is he okay? Are you quite all right? Uh. It was perfect. Perfect, perfect, uh -oh. perfect. Uh-oh, uh-oh. You have sullied it with knowledge, made it an unclean sacrifice. I will remember your Oh, face. I guess we found the murderer. And I will peel it from your skull, should you interfere again. What is happening? What is happening? What is happening? What? Oh, I get, no, no free wine. Damn, okay. Um, hmm. So much for the free wine. I tried to save the lady. Oh dear. Reroll that, yeah. No, we're not gonna reroll all of these. Well, this is this is the situation now, isn't it? Yeah, this guy's just running. Okay. Ah, uh, I don't know what just happened. I'll be honest, but that's okay. We're just gonna go boop 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 boop. Serio. Nice. And then we do a little boop, boop, boop. Oh, critical miss! Come on. It's all good because big damn. No, that's not gonna work. Uh, let's do eighty-one, and that missed with an eighty-one percent chance. That's that's unfortunate. Can I need him? There we go. There we go. Much better, much better. Those things are creepy. I think I wrecked the party though. Unfortunate. Um, we I should have attacked that guy. I was gonna attack him before the end of that, but I was like, oh no, that's I don't know. But no, it seems I should have. Now he can't use any reactions. I'm heating up. All right, Garlock, just end this. Oh, all right, or precision die first, and then. Thank you. He's gotten away. He's gotten away. Is that him running? 
Oh no, Zinfandel is running. Oh. Oh dear. So, yeah, so the murderer super got away. Alright, so it seems that when I go talk to the possible murder victims, I need to keep an eye out for that guy. Wow. That's not what I was expecting. Tombstone shop key. Ooh, a promising candidate. Interim report. The Scarred Dwarf is a promising candidate for the Unholy Assassin. Though he is personally crude, his methods of homicide are artistic and even innovative. He has set up a deadly wine festival to eliminate his next target, and I, for one, will be observing it closely. Shalar Cole. Huh. Have to keep going. Strong paralytic poison. So what is Let's this place? This Cora, you lived, right? Like Yeah, Cora lived. That's the good news. Hmm. Happy to help. I still can't believe Why would anyone want to kill me? Thank you for saving us. Oh, so he was trying to escape with Dimension Door immediately, but that's what I counterspelled. Got it. Oh, she gave me a thousand gold. Hey, I'll take it. I still can't believe. Why would anyone want to kill me? Yeah, it, I. Looking back, my approach perhaps could have been a little bit better. Thank you for helping Cora. <laughs> a guide to Sword Coast wine. I still. No, okay. Talking to that guy just talks to her. Um, nothing too crazy in here. Okay. So, yeah, we just gotta do our best to protect her. And hope that he doesn't come back and try to strike again immediately. Neat. That's not what I was expecting. I was expecting to just warn her and be like, hey, go into hiding. Now on to Mistra, and now it's like, of course, nope. Okay, so we need to continue, what, this way? This way. And ideally, we go into the tavern real quick to collect our reward. Have you any idea how hard it is to make an automaton have manners? Go on in. I think, what was it, back in the kitchen? Our reward? Yeah, this guy. Your rats are dead. You kill the rats yet? I heard commotion in the cellar. Good. Perfect. Here, you take this. And do not worry. Chef Revere's eyes will be kept most peeled for murderous knaves. Nice. Got a reward. That's how we got into the sewer in the first place, right? Oh my goodness. That was the whole thing. All right, and then Mistra is going to be where? In this building, it looks like? Who's this? Listen and submit to the Mistress of Disease. Let's go around to the front. I don't think I'm supposed to grab that stuff. That guy's really uh, pumped up about Gortash. Alright, well let's see how this goes with Mistra and everything. Oh no, that's not... Are we in the right place? Yeah, meet with Mistra in the Stormshore Tabernacle. Oh, yeah, with the statue, that's right. Uh, okay. Let's see how this goes. There she stands, just as Elminster promised. Mistra, goddess of the weave, mother of all magic. The old man wasn't lying. She's opened the summoning channel. Can't you feel it? Huh. Gail's right. The very air around the statue crackles with magic, as though the weave itself were coursing beneath her stony skin. A stream of pure undiluted weave. I only have to reach oh. out 
and it will carry me to Mistra, wherever she may be. Oh. Go on then, Gail. <laughs> we'll be here waiting for you when you're finished. Time was I'd have given my right arm for a chance to speak with Mistra again. <laughs> the left one, too. Maybe a knee. You got this, Gail. Am I? You're right. I am a strong, capable wizard. <laughs> and this is no more than a casual reunion with an ex-lover. Mm -hmm. My omnipotent, omniscient ex-lover. Of course, yes. I always wonder what being nervous would feel like. <laughs> I hate it. I always wondered what being nervous would feel like. You know what you're gonna say? During my time locked away in Waterdeep, I prepared a quite comprehensive speech for her on the subject of our former relationship and the manner in which it ended. Alas, recent events have rendered the majority of it moot, so I'm gonna have to improvise. Unless you have any words of wisdom to impart before Ooh. I go. Sounds important. You're not taking me with you? The summoning channel Mistra has provided is for me alone. No one else is permitted to enter it, no matter how talented a user of the weave they are. Okay, so... Seek her forgiveness, make her squirm. I want to tell her, I'm inclined towards number three so far. Like, what does she have to say? Like, yeah, don't... Let's see what the deal is. Feel it out. That's what I'm gonna do. Find out what she has to say. You'd make a fine three dragon anti player, you know? I think it's best I keep a cool head going into this. Approach it like a particularly high risk round of three dragon anti. I'll let Mistress show her flight, and then I can see how strong a chance we stand of winning the gambit. I'll only be gone for a matter of moments. The outer planes experience time quite differently to our own. Wait for me. Please. Okay. Do we get to see? I hope so. Get to find out. There he goes. Uh-oh. Gail, stay strong. Gail of Waterdeep. You look well. See how this goes. As to you. But I assume we're not here solely to exchange compliments. So why am I here? You discovered what lies at the heart of the Absolute. The crown of causes. She's got quite a lot. And you disobeyed my instruction. Why? Because you had no right to ask that of me. You cast me out. Remember? You were my lover. My chosen. Yet still you know so little of me. The chosen. The past cannot be undone with self-pity. Nor can a future be forged. Only with the truth will you see the way ahead. The fragment of magic you tried to return to me was not of my creation. It was the Carsite Weave. It is a corrupted, half-born magic. Oh. Wrought in the brief moment Carsus ascended to godhood. It hungers for power, just as he did, and it can never be sated. Oh. You unleashed something that would consume all magic in existence, and yet you thought only of preserving yourself. So that's what you're scared of. With the crown of Carsus reforged, I could take control of the Carsite Weave. You can no more control the Carsite Weave than a weather vane could control a storm. That it entered your body and consumed no more than your powers was a miracle. But we will not be granted another. The only reason the orb sleeps is because I have allowed it to feed on the true weave. Oh. A temporary measure, but one that will not be enough oh. to save us. With each day that passes, 
The Elder Brain threatens to become a new kind of god. Its worshippers, a scourge of soulless illithids. If you will not use the orb to end this abomination, then you must find a way to separate crown and host. Oh. When you've done this, you must surrender the crown of Carsis to me. A great ask indeed. You've given me much to think oh. on. As you always did. So be it. Follow the needle of your own wisdom. We shall see how truly it leads you. So she wants the crown. So that gives us another option of what to do with it. Weird. The car site weave. I had no idea. He's like, wait, this is what cool. This means? The orb is no stray piece of ordinary magic. It is something entirely different. The nascent form of a new divine power. Of course, I couldn't control it. I was mortal. But once I reforge the crown, the power of a god will be mine oh, to command. Oh, he wants it. The orb will answer to me. Yeah, a new hand touches the weave. Okay, yeah, so it does sound like a little, little evil, but, um... So he wants it. So it's not even our character. He wants to take it. I don't know. Evil is a reductive term. Too often used to dismiss choices the observer lacks the imagination to understand. Let me assure you, Carsite Weave has no more inherent evil to it than a, a child in the womb. Or an axe half forged on the blacksmith's anvil. Okay, I don't know about that. It is a tool. Okay. Dio, I need you to, to get out of here. Shaped by Buddy. its wielder. No. By me. And you know me to be someone of reasonably sound moral judgment, don't you? I mean. Yeah, that's good enough for me, I suppose. Interesting. God, it's refreshing to share the company of someone who sees know. things the same way I do. All we need to do is stay focused on the task at hand. Defeating that elder brain. It... After that, you can leave the rest to me. Here's the thing, it does feel a bit hypocritical hypocritical for us to be like no do not take any power after we have like a bunch of worms in our brain you know like i will just say that much statue of tear can i do something here hello you see an altar dedicated to tear tear the blind god offers justice to all innocent and malefactor alike the law dictates what is right, mm. be that reward or retribution. Mm. His unseeing eyes are a testament to the lawful life he lived and what it cost him. Make a sacrifice out of your own pocket and you may yet be blessed. Oh. Uh, I don't know. It's all about lawfulness. I don't know if we've been very lawful lately. <laughs> in progress essay marching armies people will not turn to the gods who allowed this to happen but to the dark entities who might have had the power to stop it Ooh. so wood is all over here so speak at the guild hall so that's the Jahira's whole thing we don't want to start that yet there's all right, I think our next thing needs to be a Starian, right? I think we need to go take him. Also, I never... I 
I never found um, anything in the steel watch place that might have helped Carlac. It mentioned that there were different things that... Hmm, I wonder if I could have helped her there before blowing that up. Tarot cards originally used were, were originally used for playing games like that. Did they make it through? Please make it. Thank you. Wow, they actually did. And we got another waypoint. Nice. I really need my hair doing. So you'll have to wait in line. Is this the barber shop? And they probably the Wob. Hello. Get in the bloody queue. Okay, Wob. Uh Oh, I think I'm supposed to go through these doors. Hello. It's uh, unusual for prey to supply the tools of its own. Uh oh, butchery. okay, we got here just in time. Razors, scissors. Oh, he's paralyzed, files. huh? So many cuts one couldn't make. And yet, such a fleeting window. But then, who am I uh... to deny the auspices of destiny? For we are celebrating, Master Figaro. Oh. You have the delicious honor Can I, of like... being my crowning achievement. Yep, we're attacking right now. I'm not letting him get super sliced in the neck. I don't know if there was an opportunity to jump in or say something, but it was not giving me one, and he was about to... It looked like he was going to slice his neck. That is, that is the point where, realistically, I would jump in and be like, nope. Nope. <laughs> okay, yeah. Charm. Another witness to my sacrament. Oh. Is he still here or did he already teleport? Did he leave? Where is he? Is he already gone? This is him, right? Um, needs 15 to save. What is that? Ambushed? Yeah, let's not do that. Uh, no? Oh, geez, maybe there's a better way to. Uh. I don't know how closely they watch it. Okay, uh, let's see what we can do here. So. There's probably crates and things down there to keep trash like us out. This guy is where nah, he's wrong. invisible. Oh, so we need to see invisibility. We have we have that spell, don't we? Gail, can can we see invisibility, please? Really? Nothing? Oh, that means he must be back here still. Oh, that's really unfortunate. Let's light them okay, up. well, let's have him move over here. They've seen. He's right here. He's right here then, right? That must be what that means. This could be fire, baby. Let's find out. Can I Can I like sweeping attack? Is that is that the person? Is that where that is? Like I see this thing right here. Is that Yes, yes it is. Yes, we got him. Okay, so good. Me, then. All right, that's when we use a precision attack. We do this. Think I made the right good. And then we're also going to use that extra action. Use another precision attack because this is important. There we go, Executioner. Thank you. And then we've also got an advantage here. So did we kill him? Is he dead? I hope he's dead. Okay, we don't need to go into the darkness. Stay 
focused. We should probably get her out of the darkness. Moving. Who are these people? Roy? Like, who are... Doppelganger. Oh, they're doppelgangers, too. Yikes. Um... Let's just do that. How much health do they have? I could potentially knock them out a good bit, so... Sure. Sure. I won't give in. Get plagued. Um, and then we'll go back this way. Oh, dear. Something exploded. Something did. I don't know what. Uh, we're gonna do... What? Some magic missile or something, maybe? Cone of cold. That could be kind of cool, too. Hmm. Not what we need, though. Could do just some good old wall of fire. That'd be a good one. Mm, what would, like, level 3 magic missile do? 10 to 25 damage? Dead? Okay, we got that one down. Oh. Didn't realize this was a situation. Hope they don't die. As long as it doesn't crit or anything, they'll be fine. It did crit, but she's not dead, so that's good. Yikes. Not the time to miss. Really not the time to miss. Okay. Shadowheart, let's, let's have enough this. of the plague. No more plague. Okay. Plague is gone. I'd like to use magic missiles to go there. Do that. Please. Big damn. 14. I'll take it. Something. I don't think we need spiritual weapon. Come on. Can't stay idle. Let's do some magic missile. One, two. Too far? Well, it's because I'm blinded. That's why. Let's do level two. One, two. And one, two. Very good. Alright, Carlac, please just don't miss. Appreciate that. Very much appreciate that. Thank you. Very kind. She can't get all the way over here. Unfortunate, because we have that extra attack, but we can't use that, so it's fine. No way to run a business. Very true. Very true. Please, Mistra. That didn't kill her. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, that was really important that he killed her right there. I really hope they don't die. They might die right now. Oh, jeez. Okay, no, we're gonna misty step, and we're gonna- we're gonna go body block. We're gonna go put ourselves here nobly for the cause. See? Hey, it worked. It worked. Very noble. Uh, let's just... Oop. Okay, so hopefully they cannot be paralyzed anymore. Hey, you okay? You good, my, my guy? I should speak up. I must say, I'm damn lucky you showed up when you did. Can you believe what that monster was doing? Yeah, I'm pretty sure if I long rested, he was super gonna die. <laughs> Sanctuary spell can help save people, right? Okay. Wow. Unfortunately, yeah, I've been hunting him. Truly. Then you're made of sterner stuff than I, friend. I'll confess, it terrified me greatly. Can you imagine dressing entirely in red? Can you imagine? <laughs> Jests okay. aside, thank you. You forever have yeah. my humblest gratitude and a most generous I mean, discount yeah. on my wares. If you're not laughing, you're crying, right? <laughs> Let us see in good spirits. In the face of such horror, I don't see that I have okay, much choice. Okay, well, yeah. Now, what you got? I sell in the best you'll find in Boulder's Okay, I just wanted to see your stock. Certainly be very good, ma'am. Well, we'll sell that somewhere else. Now remember, fashion's a fickle mistress, so be sure to return. Nice. So 
So, is the other person okay? Yeah, you good too? You alright? I don't know who you are. Yeah. But I'm glad you were there. She's like, thanks. If it had been the dwarf alone, we might have stood a chance. But these doppelgangers, oh, they swarmed us. We were paralyzed before we even had the chance to fight back. Yeah, they're tracking his progress. A rising star, you say? Then there's more of these nutters running around. Yeah. I thought as much. Devella Fountainhead. Constable of the Flaming Fist. Oh. I've been investigating the recent spate of murders across the city. I was on my way to the upper city when I heard a commotion. I stepped in to see if I could help. Well... It's not every day you have the chance to catch a killer in action. Not even in this profession. Now, if you don't mind, I need to draft a report to my superiors before I forget it all. But don't worry. I'll be sure to put in a good word for okay, you. Okay, well maybe the Flaming Fist will like me more. <laughs> What do you know? Come on, you owe me. You gotta tell me. Okay, critical success. Again, oh. random time for that. Fine. What? What did she say? Fine? I don't know. We were paralyzed before we even had the chance to fight back. Then the I was on. Now, if you don't mind. You do? How? Tell me what you know, I'll tell you what I know. All right. Fine. These killings aren't random. In fact, they seem to be part of some sort of test. Yes. The killers paralyze their victims, take their hands as an offering for Baal, and make it look like the cult of the Absolute was behind it all. You've seen those gruesome dioramas that have been springing up, right? Corpses posed like unholy paintings, blood everywhere. There's no way in the hells that those scenes and these murders aren't connected somehow. Now, huh. your turn. What do you know about the killings? I feel like I should tell her. I don't know. Maybe it's a bad idea, but I'm gonna tell her. God. That's it. Proof that I was right. I've been working on an assignment, see? A research project of sorts. Oh, I knew my conclusions were sound. But this... Never expected this. I'll tell you what I know. He ruled the Iron Throne. A dark tower hiding a darker secret. It was the front for a deadly arms dealing network. Okay. There, he amassed an army, seeking to become a god himself. Mm, okay. Under his stewardship, the Baal Temple was revived. Fortunately, the temple was destroyed. And to cleanse the city of Saravok's memory, the Iron Throne was torn from its foundations and cast into the Chionthar. For most, that was the end of it. <laughs> but cults like that don't disappear overnight. The Baal cult is back. And someone is out there, continuing Saravok's work. He has to be alive, right? Stranger things have come back to haunt this city. The brutality of the killings is on a par with Saravok's own. But there's something more here. Something new. There's a reference to these murders. A certain flair. It's as if they were done in worship. The precision of the cuts. The depth, the execution. The best butchers in Faerun couldn't make a there's cut There's a lot like to that. say about this. Trust me, I've asked them. Ooh. I tried to explain all this yeah, to- Yeah, that wouldn't work. I told you to drop it. They told me to drop it. Told me the city doesn't need another conspiracy theorist and to get back to doing my job before they find someone else to do it for me. Tough when the conspiracy's real. Yeah. All right, yeah, I'll help I you out. If you follow the trail of these murders, you will be able to unearth the truth of this resurgence. Try oh, you to do. convince my superiors to put some resources into this matter. After what's happened here, they might finally take this seriously. Might. Okay, well, it's good that we actually came over here then. I'm happy. Um, can you help me? Believe me. Oh, I wish I, wish I, could. I could have her come with. 
but I need this job. Okay. Well, you really are a godsend. Meet me at Basilisk Gate if you've anything more to report. And good. Well, good luck. Okay. Well, thank you. Socks. Yeah, again, set up for his final qualifying murder is brilliant and meticulous. After its inevitable culmination, I will be thrilled to join at the murder tribunal in acclaiming Delore as an unholy assassin. Well, he's dead now, so we actually got him. What does that mean? Yeah, we stopped the spree of murders by taking down the killer, a dwarf named Dolor. Like, is it Dolor? Right. We should check out his body for any clues about finding the Ballas cult. So, where was his body? Over here? Stranger Which one was he? Delore. Here we go. Ooh! Ooh! Now a bag of hands! Ah! Neath Candle Hollow's quiet tombs lies a path to murder's boons. If entry down below's your aim, seek trigger hidden by a frame. Sicarius, the door awaits to admit those who seek their fates. If you continue, you insist. Show a trophy rent from wrist of sacrifice for our Lord planned. Present death's night a bloodied hand. A past I'm assuming. And a location. We should find this candle hallow place. Oh, goody. Bag of hands. Who, who gets the hand? They're not calling the bag with severed hands a handbag. <laughs> that is not... It's... <laughs> The handbag. <laughs> no. Oh, that's too good. Okay. <laughs> yeah, circus is over here. All right, let's go back to the circus. Oh, our game's not running as well currently. We're dropping some frames for sure. I have something to ask. No, I... I'm I'm going right here. Hello. Yeah, you gave me permanent makeup. Yeah, thank you. Can I like take it off? No, I think I just have to buy a new one and put it on and then make sure that when I rest Carlac is in my party. Cool. Did Carlac have some things to sell? No, I think it was... Oh, I gave a bunch of stuff to Gale originally to get to have him sell. Catherick shield. I'm sure that's quite something. So she's still in medium armor. We have some really good heavy armor somewhere, though, that we may want to give her. Oh, I need to put her other gloves back on. She has the sleight of hand gloves because I was having her do lock picking. I forgot. This stuff, though, I'm probably going to just have her hold on to. It's like some good stuff. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to be Carlac. I'm going to be Carlac. And then we're going to take the face paint. Okay, sort by latest. Face paint. Consume. Carlac. Clown face paint. Alright, so hopefully now, next time we long rest. Hopefully it disappears. We've tried literally everything else. So this needs to work. Can I not rearrange this order? There we go. What to do? What path lies before me? Oh yeah, didn't I have something to do with this guy? Dribbles is dead! It Joyous news! He was most irritating. It Behold! Akabi's wheel of wonders is better than any. I think crowd. he just didn't want the competition. 
So I think someone mentioned like checking his inventory Watch or something. I'm wondering if there's like another way to do this, but let's have yes, him just come let's. poke around here. Our game's not running very well. We're almost done anyways. It's all good. Mm. We can't just steal like all of this stuff. What is that? Use? That's not real. That's not real. Weird. What can we rescue? Genie ring. Huh. It's where it can cast mage hand. Oh. Because then he can't take it. Thank you. I don't know if I have as good of a likelihood. Let's try. Let's see. Should I steal his gold? Oops. Oops. Did I lose the... Okay, hang on. If I sort by latest... Yes, I have the ring. I have the ring. The ring is mine. Also, let me change Shadowheart's gloves before I forget that. Those are amazing for healing. Heal a creature, it gains the effect of Blade Ward. When you revive it, it gains the effect of Death Ward. Like, that's huge for her. She is our dedicated dedicated healer lady. Yeah, and the Moonbeam thing is fantastic, too. All right, well, now... Well, it ends not as bad as it could have. Murder. Let's see what happens. You failed to win the grand prize. But fear not. Yes! You will win the jackpot this time. I am sure of it. Oh, yeah? Am I winning? I'm winning! Oh, yes, I'm winning. Possible. You thief! You cheated! How does it feel, sucker? I have no idea what you're talking about. What are you talking about? Liar. Oh. Enjoy the jackpot, muley card. All right, did he just? Damn that, Jenny! What? Where am I? What? <laughs> Where are we? Oh gosh. Okay. Well, we're in a jungle now. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Well, he got me. Intestines. Mm. <laughs> My hiding has been successful. No! I was gonna say, I'm like, there's no way this keeps going. I was getting so lucky. It's fine. It does not have much damage. Or it does not have much HP. Let's just... Oop. Okay. Time to press ahead. One way to get it done. Is there another one? Oh, the other one. Ah. Oh, what? What? <laughs> okay. Wasn't that supposed to be a melee thing? No, this was supposed to be melee. Then you can't use any reactions. Ha! Oh, well... Oh, there's someone down there. Well, I'm very interested. Where am I now? Let's just kill them, sure. Bite? Ow. No. Be charmed. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Yeah, like, what? Like, dinosaurs? I was not expecting that from this game, but okay. Sure. Yeah. <laughs> we'll pretend that makes sense. Uh, and I'm sure it does somehow. I just don't know the lore that well. <laughs> what? Do that again. And then I get to just run away. Whee! 
It could also just Misty Step down there. I'm interested in like who that is, a rock gnome. Wonder if I can speak to the dead. Right, dragons, why not dinos? True. Just unexpected. So could like force tunnel no, so they're both like right next to each other. We're just gonna Boop. Good. So keep moving. Keep running. This is so random. I don't know where he teleported me, but he he brought me here. And I'm interested to see what's here. Hmm. That's a bonus action. Too heavy. Aww. Is there another one right down here? Oh, of course there is. Of course. Let's push it back. Get wrecked. Yeah. Oh. Oh. That one's not gonna jump up there either. Okay, they're just grunting randomly. <sighs> I need them to group up a little bit. This one needs to die, but like I have the high ground advantage, which is what I wanted. And it did nothing, Ah. What if I just... Hmm, I don't even really know where I want to go, so let's let's not do that. Too heavy, gosh dang. <laughs> We're taking some damage here. That one's just not gonna jump up there, nope. saying I can just go. I mean, I just kind of wanted to explore, so that's mainly why. Like, I wanted to see if I could cast, you know, speak with the dead on that guy. And I can't necessarily always. Yeah, it can only be cast outside of combat. I'm just kind of curious, like, if I can even cast it on him in the first place. Not even sure. Okay, if they would just group up... Well, here we go. Here. Here's what I can do. That's something I can do. Nice. That one gonna jump or is just gonna hang out forever? Hang out forever, I guess. We've got enough health. We're fine. We're fine. Like, yeah, we could teleport over there, but like at this point, they're almost killed. Come on, one shot. Thank you. Amazed that actually worked at this point. All right, one left. Finally, it comes up here. My goodness. Do big damage. Uh. Dang, we almost got it. I'm just gonna misty step on down here. Uh oh. I knew that was coming. <laughs> that did not work out how I wanted. Oh no. All right, I need just some anything with a hundred percent chance to hit. Just please die. Thank you. Okay, who is this person? Who are you? Yeah, we can speak to them. Okay, I knew it. I knew it. No. 
I was so excited. I was so ready. Oh. Okay, well, let's at least see if there's anything to find in here. Since, since we've been through. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another. I don't need any attention right now. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's restore some spell slots. Let's go ahead and do that. Maybe just uh, a little bit of a little bit of healing. Light on my feet. Don't want to draw any attention. I wish we could just be friends, you know? If only. I'm sorry we can't be friends. I apologize. Oh no, it's gonna hit me. I'm just gonna... Can I hit it? No, that's not gonna hit it very well. Um, maybe that? Let's do that. Okay, and there's more people up here. Maybe the she'll talk? No! To <gasps> dino nuggets. No. The poor dinos. Ooh. We got some stuff. Arcane cultivation. I think that's just for like one day. I don't know. Cool. Journey through the jungle. The sun had just fallen below the horizon when I first heard its call. A thousand reed pipes at once, whistling a single, beautiful, terrible song. Ulu Thalong, said Jaw. It's coming. Jaw dropped her pack and scurried up the nearest spider. With a bit more effort, I climbed a tree of my own, and the two of us surveyed the grassy ground beneath. Ah, woo! There it was again, above and beneath and all around, so close my skull vibrated from the sound. The ferns and foliage under me rippled and swayed. Jaw held a finger to her lips to demand my silence. And in one motion, it snatched her. A vine? A tentacle? It hardly mattered. The hunter had found its prey. Jaw's scream swelled, then faded, as Ulu Thalong dragged her away. I leapt down to give chase, but the creature left no mark behind. The grasses were untrampled, the shrubs unbroken. I had only the memory of that harrowing call to guide me. Ooh, creepy. Am I over encumbered? No. Right? Almost. Well, interesting. Uh, how do I get down here? Get me down. There's some roots. Perfect. Skeleton's portrait, so classy. True. Fancy skeleton. Is there something, like, over here? Is there, like, something? It looks like there's, like, things to find here if you look, but I don't really know. Yeah, there's another body. There's another skeleton. Creepy elliptic powers. Yay. 51 gold. How random. Can't target undead. Huh. Oh my goodness. Ike, thank you for gifting five subs. Can we get some hype in the chat? got a sub. I hope you enjoyed being here, being part of the community, the brand new emotes that we just unveiled today, and uh, just thank you, Ike, for supporting the stream. That means a lot. Hope you like it here. Thank you. It's been a great night. Happy I was uh, feeling good enough for a stream tonight. My apologies, I missed yesterday. But, yeah. Sometimes that's how... Uh, it is. Okay, we need knock. Let's put knock instead of cone of cold right now. We haven't really been using that. Hey guys, if you got a sub, again, hope you like me in here. Hanging out. What? A legendary trident. What is this? This weapon will return to your hand when thrown. You cannot be forced to drop the trident. When thrown, the weapon creates an explosion that deals 3 to 12 thunder damage in a 6, in a six meter blast centered on the target. 
That's cool. Veil of the Wind. You gain three meter bonus to movement speed and jump distance. Equipping this weapon gives you immunity to falling damage. This thing is crazy. Who do I give that to? The Forge Master Lyrico designed this weapon for the champion of the wind goddess, Akati. A key component in the forging was his home city's wind, and for a year after the weapon was made, no wind blew there at all. I'm gonna send that to, what, like, Karlak? Who do I even give that to? That might be better for her. Interesting, I don't know. Who normally, like, throws weapons like that? Oh, also, Asterion definitely needs a better weapon. I'll switch over to him in a little bit. Um, yeah, let's leave. Whoa, what a trip. Quick saving. You've seen that trident in every must-have legendary video on YouTube? I'm so happy that we actually just went back and randomly did this right now. Because, I- oh my gosh. Did we just come out through the outhouse? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, I feel bad for the murder cat. Lucretius. Oh dear. Screaming children and oozing corpse, and it's not even my birthday. What? I thought the absolute wouldn't dare set foot in my circus. To use such a woeful dribbles impersonator. Why it's downright rude. You sure? As much as I love yeah. a good murder, my customers don't. The real dribbles, charms animals and makes puns. Awful puns. Not this. Alas, I cannot afford to lose any more staff. Funerals are so very expensive. I need to move the circus. But I cannot leave just yet. Not without dribbles. He was a star. I think Customers I have his hand. of every color and creed and simply torso. adored him. I need him back, and I'll shower the person who finds him in love, adoration, and adequate well, I'm happy we came back here. What do you say? Oh. Payment? Huh. I can respect that. And you're in luck, because I am old, darling. Ancient. Oh. I have seen stars explode and civilizations fall. Oh, really? Along okay. the way, I happened across items of such power that would make you weep with awe. Oh. Find my dribbles. You won't be disappointed. Oh. Okay. That's the spirit, darling. I mean, dribbles and is remember, definitely dead, but... I look after those who make me happy. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Okay, can we can we like mention the torso Hello that we found? Again, my vicious little No, we can't. Does that give me like Oh yeah, the hands. Oh yeah, we took the okay, so we have the handbag. Can use these to access the Dreadlord Tribunal underneath the tombstones. Neat! Oh good. Kill Gortash, yeah? We got Dribble's severed hand. And torso. Looks like we need to find more parts. Collect Dribble's body parts. Oh. Oh good. Are they gonna mark those on the map or we just gotta just gotta find them, it looks like. Neat. Alright, well that's be gonna be where we call it for tonight. Let's get out of the circus. Hopefully Carlac's makeup actually goes away now. That would be that would be a miracle. Imagine that. Oh my. Well, it looks like we may want to consider actually going over here or something, so... We'll see. Did I save Shadowheart's parents yet? Nope, not yet. So many things to do. It's wild. Alright guys, this is actually going to be where we're going to call it for tonight. I really want to keep going. I am extremely captivated. But uh, we're going to start tomorrow's stream with some Starfield and then maybe end with this. If we don't, then we'll definitely just spend all day on Friday doing this. But we, we're set up nicely for a Starians thing and shard stuff and all kinds of stuff. So this was great. 
thank you all so much for being here. All of the amazing, amazing support tonight, all the follows, everything, subs, just appreciate it so much. And I hope you guys like being here. So that's gonna be where we call it tonight.